and welcome to the vlog of the NYU Gallatin class of 2016, also known as the Gallatin. Hey guys! My name is Janet. Buddy, I'm Emma Svet, and I'm a part of the Gallatin class of 2016. Hi, my name is Harrison Hill, and I'm Gallatin class of 2016. My name is Allison Gassar. My name is Lisa Jakes. I'm Alex Hansen. Hey Gallatin babes! I'm Leah Friedman. My name is Abby Oaks, NYU class of 2016. Woo woo. My name is Andrew Gresby. Hello, my name is Rain Holm, and I'm part of the NYU Gallatin class of 2016. I am from Waxahachie, Texas, via New Orleans, Louisiana, and Pride, Louisiana, and Gallatin, Tennessee, and I'm currently living in Billings, Montana. Hey, hey, I'm Pori Mirz Mohammadi. I'm living in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Hi, my name is Trinal Grace. I am from Pennsylvania in the suburbs just outside of Philadelphia. Hey everybody, my name is Re. it's short for Rhiannon, and I'm from Greenfield, Indiana. Okay, hi, my name is Gabby. I'm from Tampa, Florida. Well, actually I'm from this place called Land Lakes, Florida. It's like right outside of Tampa. But no one's ever heard of it. Everybody thinks it's where they make the butter. We don't make butter here. Hi, I'm Hannah Cohen. I'm from Colorado. Um, I chose Gallatin because prescribed makers bore me. Hi, my name is Otter Lee. I am a native New Yorker and I chose Gallatin because it was founded around the artist scholar model. Um, let's see. Why did I choose Gallatin? I chose Gallatin because originally I thought I wanted to go into some sort of something new to a theater. But then I, I keep bouncing around back and forth, back and forth, and I really enjoy lots of different learning experiences I've had. So I'm going to try and combine them. I, I was interested to see what Gallatin could offer in terms of me pursuing my primary academic interest. I chose Gallatin because it offered the freedom, flexibility, and community of a small liberal arts school, but within the context of a larger urban university. As it allows each of its students to take those interests, regardless of how eclectic and seemingly unrelated they may be, to refine them and create a future career out of them. I chose Gallatin because it was the only school that could handle all of my awesomeness. But seriously, I chose Gallatin because I can combine all of my disparate passions into one awesome concentration to help save the world, or so I'd like to believe. Okay, I'm supposed to tell you why I chose Gallatin, but fact is, I did not choose Gallatin. I actually applied to the College of Arts and Science as a political science major, but I guess upon reading my essay, the admissions office decided that Gallatin would be a better fit for me and asked me if it was alright if they switched my application, and I said of course. And they did, and I got in. And I'm 18 years old. I'm not totally sure what I want to do with the rest of my life, but I know that my Gallatin concentration is going to be focused on human rights and literature. Uh, my concentration is math and architecture. It's a combination of things that I'm good at and things that I love. My concentration is pop music, songwriting, performance, production, marketing. In journalism, communications, psychology, and Spanish. Something like, like aesthetics in technology as it relates to the modern world with an emphasis in 18th century romantic poetry and anatomy. To be clear, I'm not really interested in 18th century romantic poetry as it relates to anatomy. My concentration is a combination of acting and creative writing. A combination of anthropology, international relations, global ethnic studies, human rights, history, and politics with a possible minor in Latin American and Caribbean studies with the intent of going into foreign aid. Yeah, that was a mouthful. Fun fact about me, I grow lavender in my backyard because I like the way it smells, and next year, hopefully, you can expect that growing in a skybox outside of my dorm. This is my wig box. You can plan to see more of this in action in the coming years. I'm Black Belt in Taekwondo. I'm actually here at Taekwondo camp this summer, um, and I've been studying it since I was about nine, so no mess. I can fold my tongue weird because it's like double jointed or something, and I can do this. And I can make it look like kind of like a clover. 
Three things I plan to do next year. One, go to New York Fashion Week because it's important. Two, go to a lot of shows because they're also important. And three, um, learn stuff because I'm paying a, a lot of money to learn stuff, as are all of you. So I should probably get that done sometime. I plan to go and sip tea on the Highline Park. I'm a writer, or at least I pretend to be one. So definitely Saturday morning coffee shop trip, so I'll sit and pretend to be that iconic quintessential writer that you find in New York. I want to go swing dancing. I love swing dancing and I really want to um, go swing dancing in New York. Going to so see small local concerts and bands perform. And I would also love to go to different comedy clubs. Or go to a lot of local shows or concerts, whatever they're called. And going to lots of concerts because seeing live music is one of my favorite things in the entire world. And everyone awesome goes to New York, so lots of great choices to pick from. And lastly, just meeting everyone. I'm so excited to just see who's going to show up and see who I'm going to meet and make tons of new friends. And I think it'll be a really, really, really